we play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome back to The Freak Show. I'm your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. And today, ladies and gentlemen, Ease 8 Lacrimosa of Adana continues. We're going into the cave after uh, Rakota. She followed some little cute creatures into the cave. And, well, we're not really sure what's going on. Hmm. Apparently we have a drone we just sent in there. This must be a lair for a larger species of primordial. Rakota might be in danger if she wandered in here. Well, this place does look dangerous. At all, let's find the squirt and get out of here as fast as we can. I mean, sure. Oh boy. Those are eggs, aren't they? Yep. Oh, there she is, snoozing. Or knocked out. I, I don't know which. Hey, Squirt. So she was here after all. Let's go get her at all. Hold on, Sahad. There might be primordials hiding nearby. Uh, oh, right. Nothing's coming after us at all? Really? Look at all the fish. Here we go. I mean, we could save her, or we could uh, there. prepare for dinner later and feed her uh, her mentor, Shoebill. I think we'll go for the uh, feeding the mentor thing. This is going great. Uh, this is a tough one. Feels like a big one. What awesome. is it? It's huge. The King's Salmon. <laughs> Ooh, a diamond shell. That doesn't even make sense. But we got it. We'll take it. And in three, two, one, go! Mash, a eh? Mash it like a potato. Mash it like a potato. Sorry. Hey, I caught one. All right, I caught a... A diplomas. I got me some digitalis leaves. Mm -hmm. There's a hatched egg over here. All right, let's go talk to our girl. Hey, Rakota. Rakota, are you okay? Please be still. Uh, so many, so yummy. Mm -hmm. She seems unharmed. Huh? What? Huh? You guys? Where, where am I? What happened to all the yummy food? <laughs> it looks like she woke up. This is a dangerous place for us to be at all. We need to get out of here now. We have company. Oh, the creepy things are coming. They were cute at one point. Ah, the little ones. Watch out, Laxia. Huh? Oh. Ah. They're less cute. And the mama's there. Or the papa. <laughs> there. Was this a setup? Yes, the cute ones lured me here and then they put me to sleep. It's all my fault you guys got tricked into coming in here. Are you saying these primordials are intelligent enough to set up a trap? Let's talk about it later. She rejoin our party? Yeah. Sorry. I want her in. I don't think I need to really equip anything else, but we'll find out. Uh, yeah. Oh boy. One, got two. Easy. Easy times. Little, little crazy psychopathic demon creatures. Was that all of them? I hope so. 
No. No? Uh oh. Is this the final one? More are coming. We could try to make it out. They just keep coming. How many of these things are there? More than one. At all. We gotta fight our way through them. Wait. Easy. Uh oh. Uh oh. Something's coming. Is that what I think it is? Oh. Oh no, these guys? Uh oh. They're the dominant creatures in this lair. Hmm. That seems dangerous. There. Ah, what the hell's going on? Now's our chance, Adol. Let's flee before they come after us. Huh? I'm here for it. Let's go. Run like the wind, Binky. Oh, I guess Sahad's the one leading the way. The hell happened in there? Somehow we made it out. Yeah, we did. The strongest can survive here. Agreed. We're far away from the civilized world. We must never forget that the primordials have dominion over this land. I mean, for now, we are starting to kill them off. Oh. Huh? What's the matter, Rakoda? I've caused you trouble. I apologize. It's all good. Rakoda. You don't have to apologize. I got carried away as well. It could have easily been me who got captured instead of you. It's fair. She's right. Besides, all us castaways what washed up on this island, we're sort of like a family, you know? Family always sticks together and helps each other out. Eh, sometimes. Family? Yep. All right. Let's get out of here as fast as we can. We must tread very carefully as we proceed, Adol. I mean... No more carefully than we were before, in my opinion. Uh, I am going to go get that healing stuff up that I want. So, uh, let's go do that. All the way back down here. To Castaway Village. And then let's go get our stuff. Uh, I'm going to check your general health today. Open up and say, ah. Ah. How are you feeling today? Ah. Beep, bloop, burp. I feel dandy human. <laughs> ah, please give me a serious answer. Oh, you found a new formula. All right, let me check it out. The delight formula. Full potion can now be brewed. Uh, okay. What do you need? Uh, ooh. Hmm, we don't have a lot of that. I'll stick to three revives and then all the rest. There you go. The 60% for now. We might come across the uh, full potion later down the road, but for now, I don't think we really need to do that. Please take care. Alright, let's go get. Some more vegetables. Nine of them there sweet peppers. Gonna get them grown up. We're gonna get our egg plants. I think I'm just gonna leave. Let's just let's just go back. I don't really feel like being at the Villaggio right now. Uh is it this one? The Titus uh, primeval forest. Sounds potentially where we're supposed to be going. Yep, this is it. Okay, right, so there's a path that leads that way. Oh, yes. Geez. It's my turn. Ooh. My turn now. Allow me. All right. Well, that worked out pretty decently. I'm not gonna lie. Pretty happy with how that actually worked out. 
There we go, we got the flash guard in there. Um, I'm not sure I agree with that. I feel like I definitely dodged that. We, we got whatever this was. It was here, and then it looks like over here we got ourselves a chest. Some more ore if we needed it, but I mean, we, we don't need it. There we are, back to full health, up near 2k HP on him. Sadly, our a young lady has a lot less HP. Switch. Oh. All right. It's these critters. It's the same species that captured Rakota. All right, so we got a little bit of damage done there. Ooh. Didn't know it did a, an AoE uh, ground slam. Oh. That did that did not feel very good at all. I can keep going. Uh, we got the remove bleed thing. Yeah. Okay, 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 we got it, we got it. Alright, so she leveled up, we got some stuff handled there. Yes. Looks like it might be Laxy, it's time to shine here in oh, just a moment. Dodge away. Okay, dodge away again. Flash move, skill finish, done. This fruit looks delicious. Right there. Right there. Yeah. There we go. All right, we got the fruit. Was that was that our first time getting dragon fruit? I think it was. Right. Thousand HP. Wow, that's. That's a lot. Uh, yeah. Okay. My turn now. Message for Adolf. Message for Adolf. Enemies. Castaway Village. Enemies. Many bees. Do your best to support. Oh, we were just getting Molly Whopper did. She, she died after I paused. That is mildly impressive. She was alive when I paused and died after the fact. That's great. Okay, we'll cover a wider area seems to be the play. I want to go take care of the raid, as usual, immediately, but... I also feel like the smarter play is to not do that right now. We are just not doing well with this stuff. Should be just about to oh, come on. I definitely rolled. You saw me mid-roll before the attack landed. Uh. Allow me. Oh, something oh there's another one. You're I absolutely did not dodge that one. It's not the first part of it. Uh, let's go with hemostatic. Cure the bleeding. Oh my goodness. These things are just demolishing me. I am not standing up at all against any of them. I'm not even sure how I got hit there, to be honest. I'm not sure how I got hit there either. I mean, maybe he slammed behind me. Alright, well, she leveled up. That at least fully healed her. So, we've got a full health uh, gal here. We get some warm lumber. Trying. Yeah. 
Really? Really? Alright. Hello? How, how is it that we were unable to break him that whole time? I really do not like this guy. Alright. Well, at least we defeated him that time. That went a little bit smoother, but honestly not that much smoother. I tried real hard to time it so I can actually get the little speed boost to get some more damage on and the timing did not work. Oh look, we have a friend. Wait, how are we poisoned? Oh, no, the poison's still wearing off. Oh, we are, we are definitely not doing well. Uh I can keep going. My turn now. Right there. Yeah. Here. Ah. All right. At least that's going on. He's down, and now we just gotta deal with this crazy dude. And all of his ridiculous amounts of damage that he could just do out of nowhere. Oh no! No! Oh no! Oh no! Really? Oh no! Alright folks, uh... Guess I'll be back in a minute. All right, we're basically back where we end up getting annihilated from. Uh, definitely did a little bit better this time around. Ooh, we got a bone necklace three. I'm not even sure what that does. Let's take a look. 500 HP. Well, it's probably better than that. Okay. So again, things aren't perfect, but roughly where we left off. I, I've dodged that like four, I've not actually been poisoned in a long time. And I've dodged that like 400,000 times now, so I'm very frustrated that I missed the dodge first time back on camera. Really, really annoying. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, we still have a little bit of healing left. I can keep going. Definitely didn't do as badly as we did the last time. All right. Let's get the big ugly here. All right, I think we got him beat. Whew, and down he goes. Uh, everything is coming up good for us. We got another Flappy Boy over here. Once we get rid of the Flappy Boy, won't be much left. Yeah. Pull away. Don't get poisoned. It seems like, despite what's her name having, you know, the weak point advantage and all that stuff. That Adol, with her just assisting him in attacking, seems to still do better than with her attacking. That's probably me just failing to control her very well. The Pan Gaia Plains. The Pan Gaia Plains. All right. We've reached the end of the mountain pass. Yes, we're finally out in the open. Sweet. The view is pretty spectacular. Don't say that while you're standing right in front of a little girl, man. I know that's not what he's saying, but. Still. Yeah, I suppose. I mean, they could have gotten a little closer to the. Oh, God. You see those things in the. Oh. Everything all over wow. the place. Beautiful. And terrifying. These things are all going to hurt. Though savage at times, 
This world can be breathtakingly beautiful. Oh yeah, so can right anything. Now, we're things. seeing the world as it was before humans came into existence. Yeah, you see there's buildings in the background, man. Not completely. Why this island, though? Hello. Uh, anyway, uh, ain't we trying to get to those ruins we saw from the summit? Yes. We must travel west through these plains to get there. Cool. Be on your guard, everyone. Cool. Let's do it. Nah, Sahad's a Sahad's a good dad. He took a, a shine to the young lady and you know, making her feel welcome, looking out for her. It's all good. I'm not getting that creepy, creepy vibe from him. I get it from a lot of other characters in a lot of other games. I'm like, hmm. Not getting it from Sahad. Sahad's a good, Sahad's a good people. You know, he's good people. I was getting like three resources right now. Oh, it's about to change though. Things are about to go all lopsided. Oh, what, what's this? It's another one of our uh, special points. Oh god. Someone's Danger. Coming out of the water. Yep. Oh, the controller's vibrating. Oh, that is not small. Oh, it's got a tiny head though. You friendly? You friendly guy? Friendly boy? It's enormous. Is this a primordial too? Yep. Yes. It must be a sauropod. The largest species of primordial currently on record. Why are Laxia and Hummel's eyes closed? We can't possibly fight this thing. Why is his eyes closed? There's only one, though. Maybe we can run away. There's more than one. There's more than two. Look. <laughs> How many is that now? Three, really, dude? What's up, guys? You don't look all that menacing. Wait, Hummel, don't shoot it. <laughs> Doesn't look hostile, which I'm glad about. It's hungry. He's just gonna om nom. Primordials eat leaves. Some of them do. <gasps> Not all primordials are vicious carnivores. They appear to be herbivores and quite docile despite their enormous size. Sweet. As long as we don't provoke them, they shouldn't show any signs of aggression. What a relief. These things would crush us, even with our orichalcum weapons. Yep. Indeed. Adol, let's be mindful not to provoke these creatures as we pass through this area. I will do my best. All right, let's go back this way. Oh, something's there. Oh, flower action here. Oh, something's there. Small leaves there. And then what's over here? It's be another one of those special dealies. A crumbled stone pillar blocks the way forward. There aren't enough people in the village to move it. How many do we need? 18? We have 16? Well, we're on our way. Uh, let's look at the map real quick. Yeah, that's about what I expected. The raid thing is not an issue. Oh, that doesn't look friendly. Oh, this stuff ah, does. It looks even stronger up close. Oh, boy. It's iguanodon. We must move carefully. Oh, he yelled at me. Yep, I figured he was going to do a tail swipe. He doesn't seem to be all that weak. Come on. God. Oh. 
Oh, that was a lot of work. I mean, I don't, I don't want to fight all these giant dinosaurs. I mean, it's kind of neat, but it's, it's not easy. These are not pushovers. Please tell me you're friendly. Oh, something's there. He doesn't seem to be too upset that I'm around right now. Oh, he looked at me though. He definitely doesn't have a trustworthy face, but he seems to ignore me. So. I found a treasure. Well, he's not mad that I stole his treasure. All right, buddy, you keep eating that grass, buddy. You're looking good. Maybe do some Pilates or something. I, I, I don't know. Why are you guys swinging? What are you attacking? Stop it. Hey, Iguanodon. What's up, buddy? can't believe it. after all the effort that I put forth, that's all we did. But, oh, okay, I didn't expect that to follow up. You horrified it at me. Oh, well, that was an angry swing. You see that? Oh, he wants to the tail. This is a big slow boy. Super angry, but big and slow. I'll take it. Some of that warm lumber? Nope. That's some ancient lumber, though. This is a big place. Oh my goodness. Alright, so that leads somewhere. I'll go check out what this dude's garden. Well, I'll have to defeat him, I suppose. You know what? After we take. Oh, God. I just did not dodge in time. I think I was even facing the wrong way. Even if my roll had gone off, I don't think it would have mattered. Anyhow, I think after we defeat this guy, assuming we do defeat him, that's going to do it for the, uh, the old episodic episode. Buddy. Jumping around, trying to figure it all out. Alright folks, that's it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Until the very next one, I have been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show. We play, we fight, we conquer.